time to go do some crawling with gold member. <laughs> yeah, plus I've got some new names out there. You guys might find these interesting. I'm going to show this to you on the table. It's a mullet build as I understand it. And we're going to go hit those lines. Yeah, check this thing out. Let's go. Starting out with the J Concepts Creep Body, as usual. Here we go. This is the Amazon chassis. I've got Dravtech shocks front and back. Got a Three Brothers RC G13 Pro. That thing is good to 5S, guys. 5S. Got a Holmes Crawlmaster Mini B2. Got a, let's see what kind of motor I got in this thing. I have no idea. I know it's a revolver style. It is a 1800 KV revolver V2. Man, I'm kind of old. And I got to put that on there too. But anyways, uh, plastic drive shafts. I'm probably going to have to put a Vitavon drive shaft up front. I'm not sure just yet. But anyways, got a 10-3 portal in the back. Got the element axle up front. So it's straight front, portal rear. Got the J Concepts Tusk tires. Cheap wheels off of Amazon. And GT5 radio. <laughs> and I believe that's it. And we're ready to do this thing. Let's go. Let's get this thing started off with one of the new name climbs right here. We have Crowley. You guys may notice a theme here, but let's see if I can get Crowley with gold member. And make a nice little pull up onto here, make the transfer over to the edge. Yes, yes. Nice. Come on, gold member. One billion dollars. Come on. Oh. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Done. That's right, Cowley. Crowley. You just got whooped by gold member. Trucks like this do the hopper with ease. It's like there's nothing. Coming into this and getting up through that crack right there. It is usually pretty darn rough for any truck. And this is gonna be also kind of rough. But I was able to turn into it and actually get up on that. Oh, I just spun the front drive shaft out. I'm about to put a bit of on drive shaft in that front end. You can see right here, it just kind of pulls and extends right out of that. So. I'm just simply going to pull and push that thing right back in. And we're good to go. The drive shaft is out of phase, but oh well, it's going to be fine. Check it out. I finally put a name on this climb. It's called Jack. Let's see if I can jack this thing over and get this to hook and make the climb here. Ooh, Jack might get me here. Let's see if I can get this. This is a tedious one. Ooh, all up into that differential right there. Get that to come up. Oh, Settle down. The back end went into that groove right down there, which may actually cause a traction issue in which the entire tire was just rotating the truck over. Man, that jack is tough. Always be careful when you got jack around. Let's see if I can get that front end, get that overdrive to make the hook, which it's not going to do. Oh. Jack is about to knock this truck off. Oh, if I can get that tire to get the hook, get that overdrive to somehow make it, which it's not going to do. You see how it's standing up? Get it to fall down over there down into that groove like that. Maybe, I don't think gold member's gonna get up Jack. Get that front to hook like this. All right, I'm not in a bad position here. It's just uh, a position. Come on, gold member. All right. And get that front to make a little bit of contact. If I get the skid in between those two right there, we're done. Simple as that. Ha ha, Jack, gotcha. And here we have Castiel. All right, you gotta come up through here and get across that without falling over. So yeah, you kinda gotta 
stay on the rock up here. Kind of like this, but you got to be on the rock. You can't fall over like what I'm doing here. Get that to go over, get thing in, in position. There we go. There we go. Ha ha! Done. Bumblebee is just a nice entry level climb. It doesn't, everything doesn't have to be crazy violent. Just simple and easy. Bumblebee tuna. <laughs> this climb is actually not too bad, I don't think. It's called Ruby. And I just went across it completely wrong. Maybe it's worse than I thought. We're gonna ease right up through here. And Ruby, you gotta get this to this. So we gotta get through that. Got a little bit of steepness to it. See if I can get around so we can get a little bit idea of the steepness of it here. I may have to give it a little bit of throttle to bump that front end up. Let's see if that works. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Man, that front end is so close to getting that. Look at that. Is it gonna settle? No, it's not gonna settle. Okay, I underestimated Ruby. Let's see if I can get that front tire to get just a little bit of a grip here. Oh, look at that. Guys, let me explain what just happened. I used the tire and actually caught this right here. And that physically held it just enough. I mean, we're right on edge of walking right at Ruby. Ruby's, Ruby's tough. I'm impressed. Ruby's tough. And one final climb for today, we have Dean. Dean can be done a few different ways, but I kind of think the easiest way is to kind of throttle it and get up on it like this. And hopefully, Got to ride the inside tire, get all the way over there to the nameplate. And if I can get that, hopefully the back will drop and set me up good for a climb in. I don't know that back end has got to drop so I can get into a better position here. It's not going to do it. Dean might be a little bit tougher than Castiel. If I can get up on it like this. There we go. Nice hop. Now that back end is low. We're gonna get a hook right up through here. Look at that pressure on that tire, even on the climb. All right, we got it. We got it. Haha, <laughs> Dean has been conquered. Well guys, did you pick up on the theme? It was uh, kind of threw Bumblebee in there and kind of mess you up a little bit, but there is a theme to that, and it was from a TV show, and I still have a couple more that I've got to get put out as obstacles go on there. But I do got to tell you, Ruby was way more difficult than I expected. I just thought Ruby would be a nice, easy one to go up, you know? Easy. Uh, Castiel's been done quite a, few, quite a few times. It's just really hard to keep on that without falling off and actually hitting the bottom or off the ledge onto the bottom, the surface underneath the ledge, if that makes any sense at all. But um, I still got Sammy to put up. And uh, Sammy is uh, one of those names that has got to have something special behind it. But anyway, guys, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, awesome crawling. This th The gold member uh, does awesome. It is awesome. It's kind of evil like Crowley, but it then gets the job done. Check that description. Use those links. Go to exocagedrc.com. Uh, you guys are awesome. Hopefully, hopefully you give it a big thumbs up. Guys, thank you all for watching. If you're still watching, you are top shelf. You are the cream of the crop, the pick of the litter. You are phenomenal. Thank you for watching to the end of the video. It means a lot to me. Now, down below, there are links for the products you see. Also for channel memberships, if you guys want to be a part, channel members get early viewing on pretty much everything that I can. So guys, check that description. There's a lot of info down there. Thank you all for watching.